What's up everybody? Welcome to another episode of The Greatest Vlog in the World. My name is Jeff, your favorite tour guide in Madeira, and it's a beautiful day today in the springtime in Madeira to see some rooftops. So that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to take you out to some of our favorite rooftops and one or two new ones actually, so it should be fun. Let's go. Calling this one influencer rooftop, right? This whole video is uh, because of you guys, all the influencers who are making our work just that little bit harder, right? <laughs> you know, back in the good old days, you could show off one rooftop and everything was good, but now it's like, you know, top five, top 20, top 30, top 40, top 50. So uh, viewpoints are in fashion and I'm hoping that you guys appreciate the rooftop. And this one is the Sea Boutique Hotel rooftop. Uh, it's a hotel in the center of town as you can probably make out um, a hotel that i quite often recommend and uh, i love to joke around about it being the influencer rooftop because everyone comes here at sunset to take the influencer shots and you can't blame them it's absolutely beautiful so uh yeah thank you uh Sabotique hotel for letting us show off your rooftop and to all of you guys who are watching let us know what you want to see on this channel remember to like and subscribe because uh, you're going to get loads more cool stuff coming at madeira and yeah, I mean, look at this place. It's, it's kind of kind of pretty. The weather is fantastic. Look at the peaks up there. It's all clear. Beautiful, beautiful times. Yeah. So if you want to see real viewpoints, uh, you know who to go with. Taj, Taj Benita aqui. Aliás, Taj Benita em todo lado, amor. Verdade essa. But, yeah, yeah, yeah. E depois deste lado. Being an influencer is hard, babe. You gotta learn slowly. One day you'll be the best of us. They turn around like that, shoulder, shoulder up, down. Oh, there we go. This is this is definitely influencer rooftop, Andre. I think I should get a new job. Become photographer, Jeff. Best. Só para mim. Só para ti. Look, influencers. Hey, you got influencers in the elevator. If you're following the vlog for a while now, you know that we like this place. This is the three house rooftop. And this is my party party rooftop, right? So not a big party person myself, but I do like to hear house music. And uh, this place is very modern. You can see the, the, the cocktails and the food. Nice place to look cool, feel cool. I think we got some good shots, eh, babe? Yeah. Hey, do you like it? I've got a feeling that this might be the one that she chooses. The rooftop for uh, Elisa, eh? Elisa's rooftop, maybe, we'll see. We'll see at the end of the video which one she prefers. But uh, I do want to take this opportunity to actually uh, apologize to all of you guys for that horrible idea of Scrabble that we did last week. Uh, it was horrible for me at least. You were shining, babe, but I wasn't looking too great, you know, so I didn't do too well. So, you know, we did a couple of vlogs about business, about uh, Scrabble, a Q&A or whatever when I was wrapped up with my arm. So I have been going through uh, my shoulder rehab and Thank you to all of you guys who have stuck around with all the comments for everything. Just wanted to fill you in on that. And then we are going to be bringing you more awesome Madeira stuff like this. So don't go away. And yeah, we're going to finish off our little snack. Uh, we got some tacos and we got some bao buns. We got some pretty cool cocktails as well. This might be a new favorite. So uh, yeah, come and check out Three House if you want some action. Probably on the weekends uh, and in the evenings. This is what we live for, man. That's it, babe. Scratch. Scratch. Yeah. <laughs> One of my old school uh, secret weapons, the Castanheiro rooftop. 
Uh, this is what I'd like to call the wine rooftop. It's certainly a little bit more chill uh, as compared to Three House, for instance. Um, certainly a place where you want to have a glass of wine, uh, listen to some jazz and they've got a lot of music around here as well so it's very nice. And uh, yeah, nice relaxing place. I used to come here a lot uh, for meetings, you know, so when I was speaking to important people for any kind of business meeting or something, a fancy coffee, yeah, you're gonna pay an extra 50, 60 cents for a coffee or a euro or something but you're gonna get all this view and you're gonna really impress, you know, so nice little place to impress people. Um, on the day-to-day -day. and uh, you know this is also where I'd like to mention a little bit of all the cool stuff that we've been doing and why I want you guys to stick around because there's some great stuff coming to hit the road we launched a secret tour uh, in the beginning of the week we only had 10 spaces and it sold out in a couple of hours so I see lots more coming to our patreon account and if you don't know what patreon is it's a social media platform where you can support creators who produce these kinds of content and uh, of course that way we can give you back some benefits so think of it as kind of like the hit the road madeira vip club uh, which is exactly where you want to be and everyone who joins gets into the draw to win a vacation in 2024 so you want to do that as well so yeah babes we're gonna have some sangria we're having white sangria uh, great, one of our favorites uh, during the summer or the heat, you know, it's, it certainly feels like a summer day today. It's really beautiful for uh, what, almost end of March. So uh, yeah, it's uh, sangria and cake. And the cake is really nice. You want to guess what flavor it is, babe? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's, I'll give you an, uh, I'll give you a, I'll give you a tip. The color is orange. <laughs> Number four on the list is the Savoy Palace, right, as the fancy rooftop. I've only been there once with Elisa for uh, Valentine's Day dinner, which is actually awesome at the Galaxy Hotel. And now we're going to go up there, we're going to try to get up there and have a cocktail. I believe you have to have 10 euros minimum consumption or something. So you have to at least buy one cocktail for like 10 bucks. Let's see how much the cocktails are. I have no idea. I also don't know if I'll be allowed in, you know, Simple Jeff. Hey, I don't know if Simple Jeff will do it, if we're gonna be allowed to film and all that stuff. YouTuber troubles. Although I am very grateful that I have my jacket with me. It is a little bit cooler in the uh, evenings. So thanks, babe. That was your idea, huh? <laughs> I wasn't gonna bring a jacket, and she was like, bring a jacket, long pants. So let's see. Let's see if Simple Jeff can get into Savoy, huh? This feels like my school days when we used to kind of uh, try and break into fancy hotels to swim in their pools. Now we just want to drink their drinks, you know? And we want to pay for them as well. So let's see. Hopefully you guys can come with us. So let's try getting to Savoy. Let's go. First time on the vlog, yeah? over here so you pay at the bottom first before you can go up you get this little cart we're in the elevator to get up to the top you actually have to go through the galaxia entrance 16. and i'm allowed to film anything anywhere say anything because i paid 45 bucks for three drinks it's like miami right but it's like miami it's let's like pretend miami. we're in the u.s Right, so it looks like all the cocktails are uh, like uh, Galaxy, Galaxy, Galaxia. I was gonna say Gala Galaxia. It's already from a couple of couple of cocktails, but they're all uh, space themed, which looks good. So you're doing the well, well, which one was it, Andrea? Dark, Dark side, side of the, of the moon. moon, Dark Side of the Moon, Sunrise on Mars, space truck for you. A single espresso is three euros, and a space truck or well, Sunrise on Mars is twelve euros. 12 plus 3 gives 15, which means I can have a cocktail and a coffee. Cocktails have arrived, they look great. I just tasted mine, it's super strong and super small. Uh, that's how I like them, do you know? Super strong, super small. Anyway, um, there's another little yellow joke for you. Uh, <laughs> you know, all jokes aside, uh, this list is no in particular order. 
um, you know, so Savoy is not fourth on the list, just so you know. Uh, we love all of this, I think it's perfect, I think it's great, the sunset is fantastic. So uh, yeah, we're going to enjoy our cocktails and we're going to head, head out to the last, to the final rooftop for you guys. So don't go away, we've got more cool stuff coming. Yeah, let's do it, we're going to enjoy the Savoy. Hey, we're going to take some photos. Let's take some photos. This is an epic pool, by the way. I would come here and spend the day here for like a couple of bottles of wine, one or two bottles of wine, and just chill out in the pool. I don't know if you're allowed to. I don't know if I'm allowed to say this, but yeah, the, the rebel in me wants to do that kind of thing. <laughs> it's time to get out of Funchal. So the viewpoints that you've seen, I keep saying viewpoints, the rooftops you guys have been watching have all been in the center of Funchal. Now we're heading out to the Lido, which is about a 30 minute walk outside of Funchal. And uh, we're gonna show you a rooftop that I've never been to, that we've never been to. So it should be, should be fun, it should right? Be fun. Will be fun. Yeah. yeah, yeah, let's go. Obrigado. Yeah, so this is it. This is the final rooftop. And as you can see, it's night time already because we are overworkers and underachievers. No, we actually we actually achieve pretty well. But anyway, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. So it's uh, it's already past sunset. We're out here on the last one. I think we're all quite tired. I think Andrea's quite tired as well. Let's get a little bit cold, so we're done. But I actually quite enjoy this place, Allegro, the first time. This is the adults only rooftop, right? So. You don't get too much uh, adults only things in Madeira. I can imagine that, uh, that it probably comes into good use uh, for those people who are looking to get away from the families and things like that in busy times like Easter and, and you know, school vacations and stuff. Uh, and speaking of busy times, if you guys are coming out to Madeira this year, and especially if you're coming out to Madeira or Madeira, Chikupa, uh, in the next uh, couple of weeks, and you definitely want to do yourself a favor and book early because it's starting to fill up. We at Hit The Road are almost fully booked for April, right? And we're not in April yet. So things are going to get crazy. And again, if you want to have the best island tours in Madeira, places that you cannot find on your own, even with all the YouTube information out there, then check out hittheroadmadeira.com. Put in Hugo for President in the promo code to get you 10% off and you're gonna get the best tours in Madeira. Uh, hey, right? Yeah, so that's the deal with that. And yeah, this is the Lido. This is a great place to be staying in the next few months, right? Because you've got access to the beach. You've got all of these little promenades here, a real summer, spring, summer location, just a little bit out of Funchal. It's a 30 minute walk or something. And of course, we will bring you more information about the Lido, right? So for all of you watching and saying he's, he's always in Lido, but he never shows us Lido, right? So you, we will show you Lido. And uh, first, nine euros for a cocktail. So not that much cheaper than the Savoy, you know, just a little bit, huh? but, and again, no, please don't, all, all the hotel directors, please do not kill me, okay? I'm just an innocent YouTuber here, all right? So please, you know, before we start getting into trouble, uh, is it good? Is it good? What, like from all the rooftops? No, we're not going to do that. <laughs> we're not going to do that. But what we are going to do is we're going to choose. So uh, throughout the mission today, I can't remember if I mentioned it earlier, but we were checking which uh, rooftop that Elisa preferred the most. So we did it with photos. So I've been taking photos of her with a phone to see which one was like the best rooftop that she was going to enjoy. And if you want to know that, then you have to stick around for the next video on Thursday, uh, which is our YouTube shorts coming out this Thursday. If you want to decide, if you want to guess also which one is, was her favorite, then go ahead and guess. And uh, on that bombshell, I think uh, that's it. So stick around, more Madeira stuff coming. I wish you guys all a fantastic week and Andre? Let's hit the road. Let's hit the road. Ching ching, babe. It's a wrap. Yeah. <laughs> what are you drinking? Mm. Hmm? For me, it's time to get some serious business. It's uh, whiskey.
I'm a whiskey boy, and uh, this is now whiskey whiskey o'clock. Not too much. I'm gonna have one whiskey, and then we're gonna have dinner, and then we're yeah. probably gonna pass out. It's been a long week, a long, long week. Anyway, yeah, love you guys. Ciao. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of the greatest vlog in the world, and my name is Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? Yes. So in this video, we're going to show you some awesome. Oh, the oh come on. Man. <laughs>